Romans 8.28 simply states from the King James Version of the Bible. And we know that all things work together for good to them that love God, to them who are the called according to his purpose. On today, I simply want you to acknowledge that you are the called and you are called according to his purpose. And therefore all things work together for your good. May we pray. Gracious heavenly father, we come as humbly as we know how. Thanking you for a new day, which you have bestowed upon your servants. As we begin to start this day, and as we begin to approach your throne, we ask you to forgive us of our sins of omission and our sins of commission. And we ask that you prostrate our hearts in the correct direction so that we're not looking from side to side, but we're looking up to you so you can give us the guidance that we need so that we can make it through one more day. We ask you, Lord, to prepare our hearts and our minds to engage the struggles of the process that lead us to our purpose. We ask you, Lord, to touch those who have sickness in their body. We ask you to touch those who have struggles and trouble in their homes. And we have a homeless population, Lord, that needs your touch. They need you to intervene on their behalf. And we ask you to bless the children as they head out to school and to work on today. And as we begin this day, we understand that there are going to be some ups and there are going to be some downs. But help us to understand that no matter what we deal with on today, that all that we endure is working for our good. The things that are easy and the things that are tough are working for our good. The good times and the bad times are working for our good. The obstacles and the hindrances, they are working for our good because they build up our faith and grow our character in you. And for that, even though they may be struggles, we say thank you. So we ask you to prepare us for, for what lies ahead on today. We ask you to give us the knowledge and the wisdom to be able to handle anything that is thrown our way this day. And we're going to be so careful to give you the praise as we strive to do the good works you've called us to do. So, Lord, let us be locked in on today. Let us be steadfast, unmovable, always abounding in your work so that you get the glory, you get the honor, and you get the praise. For thine is the kingdom, the power, and the glory forever we pray. Amen, amen, and amen. And remember that you are the called. You are called according to his purpose. So remember that whatever you endure on today is working out for your good. God bless you.